shopping. There are days when you walk in with two different colored shoes and you're lucky if you have a shirt on. You think you're a bad parent. And it has nothing to do with being a bad parent. You just don't have the tools you need yet. You're learning how to grow with your child. That is different than anybody else. I know parents work harder when they have kids with special needs. They reap special rewards. But at the same time, these are unique individuals. I am greeted by everyone. They know who I am. Um, they've become part of my village for my family. I like to be here. I like to be at the village. It makes me feel good to be around these people who know me and love us and celebrate our tiny victories because they're huge in our world. If you don't tell anybody this, <laughs> I'll tell you my, our secret here. 75 to 80% of what we do is just listen. I mean, that is truly what we do. We just sit and we listen. There's a lot of mission to this job. I mean, these folks have the big halo over their head because they are doing incredible work. One of the great things about the village is that lots of us have siblings and kids with developmental disabilities. So we aren't just working here. This is really part of our families and who we are. I love the people that work here. They, they're passionate about their job and they, they have such a passion for children. I love what I'm doing. I love working with the kids and I love working with the families. What is Children's Village? It's speech therapy, behavior therapy, occupational and physical therapy. It's early intervention, family support. There's a dentist's office that specializes in kids with disabilities. There's daycare here. You can walk across the hall and talk to the pediatric dentist or staff a kid with the behavior assessment team, or talk to a physical therapist or an occupational therapist. These are things that other programs and other places don't have to offer. And it's sitting right here in Yakima, under one roof. It takes a village, really, to work with these kids. Little Carter here has occupational therapy, physical therapy, speech therapy, early intervention, educator. The whole village is really working to help. Him feeling empowered, he can sit up now and he can stand in his walker if he wants. I get to see the first steps that they take. I get to see the first time they move and get to a toy, and then how excited they are because they did it themselves and they got there. Crash! Best part. And we get to help them get there sooner and get there faster. And when you get to do that every day for your job, of sharing that joy, that's, that's being a physical therapist here. There's a certain magic here. There's a magic here that exists for families and children and those of us who work with them that is it's special and it's it's hard to define but it's here it's here at children's village well, you're telling me with your voice what about with your eyes hi edgar you wonder what's going on you're just so cool everyone wants to be your friend and know about you Think of that. Hello. Hello. Good to see you. Good job. I like that. I like that people want to get to know you. Get to know how you communicate. I know that I'm educating the community because Children's Village has educated me. We give families tools to help them succeed and to empower them in being an advocate for their child in the future. A little bit of hope and a little bit of help isn't enough. The water cannon? Oh yeah. Okay. Our goal and what we do is actually go beyond that to the point where they are really experiencing joy with their children and joy in their life. <laughs> this is cutting edge. This is the unique future of services for children and families. Unique in the nation. And here it is right here in Children's Village in Yakima.